Boom! Good day, good day, good day. Let us know where you're at in the comments. Let me know you guys can hear me good. Make sure this mic is working all fine and dandy for us. I'm really going to go deep into the weekly email strategy today. The thing that has got me where I am super excited about this. So, yeah, I see everybody rolling in. Good to see everybody today. Hope you're doing super well wherever you are. Looks like we got some people from South Africa, all over the States, in Canada, everywhere, everywhere. What is up? I got to say, you guys are my people. Real estate agents around the world are just my people. You know, a lot of people try to say, Ricky, why don't you start? You've, you've crushed the real estate agent niche. Why don't you dive into other niches? You know, and I just love the real estate agent niche. Sure, I could I could have more followers if I was in a more general, you know, niche. But I love real estate agents and I just want to help real estate agents. So just thought I'd share that while I'm here. Um, and I hope. Talking here with no sound, but um, I'm sure you can. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, you guys give me a thumbs up. If you can hear me good, I'm going to give it just a second for more people to join us today. And let us know where you're at in the comments. All right. Before I get started here in about 20 seconds. Again, just super blessed to be here with you. Super blessed to be in the position I am to just reach back to people to just share what has helped me get where I am. Let's see. I'm looking for a thumbs up. And as soon as I see that, that you guys can hear me good. All right. I got to see it here and good here and good. All right, let me dive into this thing because I don't want to waste any time here. I want to get straight to it. I want to I want to have the the I want to really maximize the time we have here, okay? All right. So let's get into it. Let's get into it. Why did it start way back here? All right, let's go back. Let's go back. Boom. I don't know why it started all the way. All right. All right. Give me just a second. <laughs> all right. And also a, a huge monsoon just hit as soon as I went live outside. It sounds like a hurricane. All right. Here we go. OK, so just so you guys know. All right. I don't know how many of you are just brand new to me or brand new to what I do, but I do not charge you anything. I don't charge you for coaching. I'm not going to try to sell you a course. There's nothing for sale here. Okay. Just want to try to help you and share what I'm doing in my business and what's got me to back to your business and straight crush. That's all I want to see is you guys doing super well. A lot of people say, well, why do you do that, Ricky? Why do you do it for free? Well, I mean, there's a lot of, there's, there's a lot to it, right? But, the number one thing is, is I just want to see you guys succeed when your intentions are in the right place that you actually want to help people. It's the same thing with your real estate business. And it's how I built my real estate business, just helping people. OK, and when you when you have the mindset that you don't care if they want to buy or sell, you just want to help them. Right. Whether it be today, tomorrow, next year, you just want to get to know and help them. Great things happen and you end up having a massive business. Same thing with the coaching business. I built my brand on helping agents for free, right? And one of the hardest working guys out there. And then what happens? I get sponsorship deals. I get startup companies calling me. I get speech, huge checks to write, to, 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 to speak, right? All over the place. So um, just, just excited to understand business of today, okay? Business of today is bringing value, 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 value. Okay. Value, value, value. That's the business model of today. Not expecting anything in return. And then what happens? You, you get so much in return, right? So much in return. Okay. Boom, boom, bam. All right. If you guys miss anything today, if there's anything that you miss, 
you can find the link. If, you, if I say a link and you forget it or, you know, you're just wondering, oh, what did he say there? Here, everything is at zero to diamond.com. OK, if you go there, create a free account. Most of you guys are probably members of that 100 percent free coaching program. There's a 90 day action plan, 90 day action plan, the exact you know playbook that I would uh, execute if I were brand new or struggling or even experienced want to take my business to the next level. 90 day action plan, scripts, videos, tutorials, course, it's all there. No charge. OK, if you missed something today, you can always go there. OK. I'm also giving away signed copies of my book list to last. OK, that's going to be all you have to do there is just text me. OK, just text me 251-312-8844. Text me at 251-312-8844 for your chance to win a free signed copy of my book list to last. So. I'll see you guys on the text messages. Also, I'm kicking off, guys. We actually, we we have the go-ahead here to do live in-person events. I've already got the first one booked in Miami coming up, and you can actually get tickets right now. The Zero to Diamond Tour is going to be a tour. Uh, it's going to be me touring around uh, the country, and I'm going to speak uh, as much as I can all around the country, and these events are going to be free of charge to you guys. Okay, free of charge to the agents. Miami's already there. I'm also speaking at the Florida Association of Realtors annual convention in, in August, and I'm putting together dates for all kinds of other cities. So you can find uh, that at zero to diamond.com backslash events. Okay, that's where you can get tickets and kind of see what I have lined up and you know what, what events are official that you can attend. So just kind of watch that page and um, that way you guys can, you know, want to come close to you. Come see me. Come see me. That's all I ask. OK, let's get into this, guys. Let's get into this. OK, what if? Let's play the what if question real quick, the what if game. All right. What if you could build an automatic business that produces 50 to 100 deals every single year? OK, this is what I built and this is what I want to share with you guys. You guys. Some of you who are probably newer to me or maybe even that have been following me for a while still don't understand how powerful what I'm sharing with you today is as simple as it is. OK. And all you have to do to keep the momentum going for those 50 to 100 deals every year is one thing every week. OK. Can you imagine a business where you're closing 50 to 100 deals automatically, which means past clients and referrals coming in? And all you have to do is one single activity every week to keep that momentum going. OK, that's what I want for all of you. And that's why I'm doing this webinar, because I want you guys to share. You know, it took me a long journey to get where I am and be able to do this. Right. But if you take not if you take how I, you know, articulate this okay, in this webinar and on my website and you really run with it. OK. What took me 15 years, you guys could accomplish in a matter of three to five years. OK, plain and simple. OK, I've sent out this weekly email to my entire database every Wednesday since 2007. Now, there was one Wednesday and you guys probably remember. Um, there was one Wednesday. Um, it was last September, I believe, when we had a hurricane here, we literally had a hurricane out of nowhere. Thought it was going to be like a little rainstorm. It ended up being this massive hurricane with tons of damage in my area Tuesday, right? Tuesday night. And that email did not go out. That was the first time since 2007 that I've ever missed a Wednesday. All right. And I've continued to close 100 deals a year since 2014. Okay. So I started this in 2007 and by 2014, I was closing 100 deals. And every year since I've closed 100 deals as a single agent and still going, this is going to be year number eight. OK, so I'm still I'm still pushing just like you guys. I'm still I closed one today. I'm still showing I had to go to the walkthrough, I had to go to the closing. OK, I'm still negotiating. I'm still showing property. I'm still going to listing appointments. Uh, I'm still doing all I'm in the trenches. I'm in the trenches with you guys every day. 
All right. Now, 2000, you know, 2007, I start the weekly email. And, and mind you, that was after I lost everything. You know, I started in 2002 when I was 20, lost everything, came back. That's when I started the weekly email when I realized it's about relationships over transactions. OK, and I started just valuing people, whether they wanted to buy or sell or not. OK, so I got back in 2008, really. But 2007, I started kind of dabbling, started this weekly email. OK, but 2014, I'm selling 100 properties. And then 2017 was the first year I made a million dollars. OK, 2017 was the first year that 100 deals actually hit a million dollars. OK, and that was the year I quit everything except the weekly email. That was the year that up to that point, I made 100,000 calls, cold calls. OK, I wrote letters. I, hand, I did handwritten letters. I did postcards. I did. Uh, well, that's really all I did. <laughs> Direct mail, phone calls and emails. And um, in 2017, when I hit that million dollars, um, I, I literally quit everything except for that weekly email. So imagine up to that point, I built my database, I built my personal brand. OK, and then that weekly email was able to continue the momentum of that of that volume every year since every year since. OK, I continued making a million dollars every year since after I quit making cold calls. OK, um, you know, I, I didn't I, I never use social media for real estate. And mind you. You know, social media is great. Use it. If I were new and if I were a new agent, I would absolutely utilize uh, social media 100 percent. Not saying don't use it, but it's just cool to know that I'm closing 100 deals automatically without using social media. It just goes to show you that there are so many ways to build your business. And one reason why I know that why I'm OK with the business that I might not be you know, acquiring due to me not being on social as much with my real estate business is the fact that. I really focused on something that was very simple and something that was very scalable. And it, and it put me in a position where I'm so busy closing deals. I don't need anything else. Right. And that's what you want. You want to you want to keep your business simple. If you'll notice, guys, the most successful people in the world make things seem so simple. They just make things seem so simple. It's like, man, you, you, you know, you're doing all this stuff and it just you make it seem so easy, so simple. OK, because they are made. It is simple for them. They're keeping it on a very simple playing field, whereas some of these lower producers and people that don't succeed. Right. They make things really complicated and they have so many things going on. They don't know. They're just kind of all over the place. OK, so remember that when you're thinking about how to build your business and what avenues to take, keep it simple. Be OK with losing a little business over here in this area. Right. And sacrificing that to really go all in right here. Right. Because all you got to do is take the fact that business is unlimited forever and closings are happening every day. And then create a scenario where you've got more coming in than you can handle. Right. Because it's a buffet, guys. There's more for you out there than anyone can ever do. OK. You, 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 there's more business for each and every agent than you can handle at all times forever. Facts. Facts. And so if you understand that and you realize that, OK, now we just have to refine and put a machine in place. OK, that's going to produce enough volume to keep you as busy as you can possibly handle. OK, that's what it's going to come down to. All right. So I'll see you guys in the chat. I just want to say much love and I really appreciate everyone. And I'm just so happy to be here and be here with you guys today. All right. Today, I want to share this strategy with you. You can have an automatic business. Like I said, you can build the same thing. It took me 15 years to build in three to five years. You just got to be willing to put that sweat equity in up front. Most people are willing to put the sweat equity up front. They just want to automate everything first. Right. They don't want to put the real work in, which is talking to people, having real conversations. They don't want to do that part of it. They just want to go out and do a giveaway and get a bunch of people and then put them in a database and start sending them things, hoping that that's going to generate a ton of business. And it's it's not. It's just not. Um, you've got to call those people after the giveaway. Introduce yourself. Tell them, hey, you're the one that threw the through the event, through the giveaway. Thank you for entering in the giveaway. You know, I'm Ricky Kruth. I'm a local real estate agent. 
you know, is there anything I could do to help you? I just want to touch base and introduce myself and let you know I'm going to stay in touch with you. And if you ever need anything real estate wise, I'm here for you. You've got to have those conversations with people. OK, or none of this works. None of this works. Nothing's going to work. You can do all the social media you want. You can buy all the Zillow leads you want. You can do all the things that you want to do besides talking to people. But none of it's going to work unless you actually talk to someone. Closings are the number one. The common denominator of all closings is a conversation. The common denominator of all closings, all closings. No closing is going to happen without a conversation. If that's the case, if that is the facts, which it is, I'm sure you guys can attest, then wouldn't the most common sensible thing to do if you want to have as many closings as you can possibly have be to have as many conversations as you can possibly have? Wouldn't that equal the 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 highest amount of, of closings, right? The highest amount of conversations is going to equal the highest amount of closings. Doesn't that make sense to you guys? And this is when I this is when it comes back to when I look at social media. Social media is great, but we're only using social media to try to get to a conversation. Right. And if you can become a great conversationalist and you have a gift of making people feel comfortable with you, which can be acquired, it's a skill that you can work on and actually acquire. Then, you know, why don't, why don't we just call people <laughs> instead of just doing all these other things? Uh, I've got a lot of stuff on YouTube and, and, and Instagram and Facebook uh, about all this stuff. So you guys can check that out. I do want to screen share my computer here in a minute. I'm going to screen share and I want to I want to take you through uh, building an email. OK, I want to take you through uh, building an email. So my story, everybody knows my story, so I'm not going to bore you here. OK, but you guys can go to the link in my bio on Instagram at Ricky Carruth and you can find my story there. Forbes did a really nice interview there um, and there's a lot of other things. And there's also my podcast. I do a daily podcast everywhere that you can follow me if you want um, the free coaching. There's tons of resources and webinars and all kinds of stuff. And I answer all my DMs on Instagram every day. So that's the best place to get me if you just want to reach out and say hello, um, so on and so forth. OK, so why email? OK, why am I using the, the email platform instead of, you know, social media or one of these other platforms? OK, uh, and it's very simple. It, it's extremely simple. OK, organic reach, organic reach, 90 percent organic reach. The social medias are less than 10 percent organic reach, meaning 10 percent of the followers you have on social are going to see your content. Email is a 90 percent organic reach, which means 90 percent of the people on your list are going to see it in their inbox. That's massive. So if you know that, then why why don't we build a foundation? If you don't do social media, great. Let's stack that on top of the email. Right. Let's build the foundation of our business on on email and then stack social media on top. If that's what you want to do. OK, but I think that I think that a weekly email on the same day of the week forever is absolutely should be the foundation of a your business and b your personal brand. OK, because when you do a weekly email on the same day of the week forever, and these people get your email for months and years and stuff. There's no denying the fact that you're the hardest worker, that you're a professional, you're dependable, you're honest. You're consistent. And those are the things that people want in an agent. This email proves it to them over time that that's who you are. It does all the heavy lifting for you to go deeper with that relationship without you having to reach out, without you having to. Because you because let's face the facts, when you when you get to 500, 1000 people, 1500, 2000 people, you can't call all those people. You know, you can't call all those people. You've got to find other ways to touch them. And this should be the foundation of it. You should also find other touches that you can do on top of it. Absolutely. If that's if that's your thing. OK, but this should be the foundation of what you're doing. Another reason is because it's so cost efficient. You got a 90 percent organic reach and it, it's it's very, very cost efficient compared to other things. OK, and it's scalable, scalable, scalability. The reason why I've, I've gotten here where I can sell the amount of property I'm selling 
and, and be doing webinars and coaching and traveling and speaking and doing podcasts and all that stuff. It's because it's a scalable activity. I can literally stay in touch with 20,000 people just as quick as I can stay in touch with 200 people. It doesn't matter if there's 200, 2,000, 20,000, 200,000. You, it takes you 30 minutes a week to build the email. Okay, 30 minutes a week to build build the email. So, um, a few things about the email, um, and that is that it's got to be original content. Okay, let's get back to the slides here. Boom! It's got to be original content. It can't be a uh, it can't be a, a a drip campaign. People don't. Want, everybody hears me say it all the time. Yeah, nobody wants to know how to cook shrimp etouffee. They don't want to know what color to paint their their walls in the fall. Ten buyer tips to nobody cares about national real estate stats. They want to know local stats. They want to know what you think about things. OK, you've got to create this every week. You creating it is what's going to give it the power of person personable. Right? It's got to be personable. People have to feel and get a get a get a piece of you, right? They have to they have to really feel like it's it's you. Um, and when you send these automated emails, these drip campaigns, they know it's a robot. And what's so funny is when you get you know in your inbox, you get four of them at the same time from three to four different agents with the same subject line. It's the same, you know, it's the same email, okay? And it's not talking about nothing, nothing. All right, so. Let's see. I'm going to take you guys through real quick before I before I share my screen. Um, Constant Contacts. That's what that's the software I use to send my weekly email. Okay, ConstantContact.com backslash ZTD. Okay, you start a free trial. See how you like it, right? Once you go to a paid membership, you just use the promo code Save30, and you get 30% off the first three months. Okay. 30% off the first three months. All right. And there's a free ebook there at that constantcontact.com backslash ZTD. So let me share that with you. And then we'll dive into my actual email. Okay. So let's see. Here is, uh, here is zero to diamond.com. Here's, here's constant contact backslash ZTD. Okay. So hold on one second. Let me get in here where I can see. All right. You guys can still see me. Cool. Cool. All right. So, so this is uh, constantcontact.com backslash ZTD. Now constant contact to me, I've tried MailChimp. I've tried KB Core. I've tried all the different places. Looked at them, tried them, messed with them. Constant contact to me is the best user friendly. Like it's got the, it makes the best looking email when you send it to people. Okay. But when you scroll down here to the bottom here and you click this button, this says zero to diamond email marketing ebook. Okay. And then you click here in this ebook, you click right there. Bam. This is right there on that link. You don't, you don't have to do anything. You can just go there and click on that link and print this out. But this is an ebook I wrote a couple years ago, how I make a million dollars every year in real estate using email. All right. It goes through my story, email journey, uh, why I started doing it, uh, how, you know, it goes into the story of me actually coming up with it, how I came up with the idea. Um, when did I start using constant contacts, how I make a million every year using it and what kind of information do I put in the email? Okay. So this is just extra material. If you guys want it, it's there. It's something that I wrote a couple of years ago and you're absolutely welcome to it. But here, when you start this free trial, you do not have to, Put a credit card in at all. You just put your name, email, password, organization name, and phone number, and boom, get started. All right, super simple. Also, I was going to show you guys this. If you go to YouTube and search Ricky Caruth weekly email ideas, there's a really good video right here. Weekly email ideas. Um, you know, weekly email ideas for retention of and retention of clients. It really goes through all four weeks of the month. It gives you incredible ideas, right? It's just a good video. I think that'll be a lot of help to you guys as well. All right. 
Cool. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, just, just to let you guys know, too, let me make sure you guys see this because people are asking now. I see. Okay, yeah, the promo code is SAVE30, and I'll show you guys this again later. All right, so, and also, you know, I let me, let me just kind of, you know, let me throw this out there real quick before I screen share and go through an email. Coming up with content for the emails, guys. Do not overcomplicate this. This can be so simple. Okay. You could start this thing out and it could be Ricky's Gulf Coast deal of the week. And it could be one listing that you think is a really good deal. And you could just have a different deal every week and just make a nice little presentation of it, right? Have it come off your website, have it come off MLS. If you don't have a website, you literally do not even have to have a website to do this. When I first started this email, I did not have a website. I literally made links off MLS on foreclosures and different deals. And I just, I just hyperlinked it to my email. It was links off of them, public links I made off MLS. I didn't even have a website. And then after about a year, I got a website and I started using links on my website, but I didn't have a website in the beginning. So not having a website, not knowing what to do for the weekly email. Those are all excuses that I just don't hear. Uh, because I was a, I was in the same boat and I still sent the weekly email. Guys, people in your database right now are thinking about buying or selling. And the fact that you're not sending an email and staying on top of mind it, it, is it, every week that goes by, they're slowly forgetting about you and they're slowly thinking about more and more to buy or sell something. And they're slowly thinking about a different agent. Okay. You've got to stay top of mind. And when it comes to open rates, when it comes to open rates, it doesn't matter because you know, if you have a 24% open rate, okay, whatever, right? But what interests me even more is the other 24% on top of that, that saw it in their inbox, but didn't open it, but they do love you. They do want to do business with you. They just don't, not ready right now. They don't care anything about it. It's not even on their mind. Or in two years, when they do, they'll open it up three weeks in a row and then call you on that fourth week. That's how this thing works. And so it, it turns into a snowball. It turns into a massive, massive snowball. And it's a lot of work in the beginning to build that brand up, have those uh, conversations, make those great first impressions. It's all about making great first impressions and collecting that data. You guys should all think of yourself as data collectors first, real estate agents second. You really should, right? Relationship creators and data collectors first, right? And, and real estate agents second. And if you, if you have that mentality, if you have that mentality, you're going to close more deals than you could ever imagine. And that's just facts. And I've seen it over and over and over again with new agents, experienced agents. As soon as I can get them to switch their thinking over to focusing on people and get out there and create five new relationships with property owners every day, five new relationships with property owners every day in your market. That's what's going to take you to the top over the next four years. If you create five new relationships with property owners in your market every day and grab those emails, put them in your email marketing machine, your personal branding machine. Okay. What happens is that's 25 in a week, a hundred in a month, 1200 in a year, 24, 36, 48, let's call it 5,000 people in four years, right? If anyone can tell me something better than calling property owners in your market for two cents a piece, just to make friends followed by and make a great first impression followed by a weekly email on the same day of the week forever, if anyone knows anything better than that, please let me know. I'm, I'm begging people to tell me something better because as soon as I find something better, I'm not only going to do it, I'm going to start teaching it. Okay, this is the most cost efficient two cents a piece for property owners with Red X. You can find that in the 90 day action plan. Two cents, of, two cents a piece for that. Constant contacts to send emails. Very cheap. This is cheap. So, so look what I'm doing, guys. I don't want you to pay for coaching and I don't want you to buy leads. I want to take those expenses right off your top line, right off your balance sheet. I want agents not to pay for coaching, not to pay for leads. Okay, let's move on to the email. All right, here we go. Here we go. 
Okay, so this is the inside my constant contact account. Here are all my emails. And by the way, guys, if you go to zero to diamond.com and go to the course that's called Ricky's Weekly Email, there's a link that goes to a Facebook page that has all my emails posted there. You can go there and look at every email. That's at zero to diamond.com. Go to the, the, the free lesson, the lesson in the free course called Ricky's Weekly Email. Okay. And then um, from there, you'll, you'll click on the link that says, look at all my emails. You can literally see all my emails. Okay. So let's dive in here right quick. All right. Boom, boom, boom. Let's see here. Make sure I'm still. All right, cool. Okay. So this, let's just go. I mean, let's, let's go here. Let's go three weeks ago. And by the way, guys, you see my open rates here. 24%. It stays pretty consistent. 24, 25, 24, 26, 27, 27, 27. That was a, that was a welcome email there. 27, 28. So you're looking at 26, 28, 27. So you're looking at anywhere from 23 to 27% open rate. And then I got a 19% click rate, 23, 20. So the click rates around, so it's about 25% open rate and you got about a 20% click rate. Okay. So that means that 25% of the people are opening the emails and out of those people, uh, another 20% are actually clicking on things. Okay. And, and also guys, think about this. You know, if you're a new agent, okay, you're a new agent. You can literally, your entire email can be based around new listings. Right. It, you, you can have your, you know, like Ricky's Gulf Coast deal of the week. And then and you guys really need to watch that video. Ricky's weekly email ideas on, on YouTube. Really good. But you, you can make it as simple uh, as Ricky's Gulf Coast deal of the week with with one listing. And then you can have a link that says click here for all the new listings in the area. You can literally be the new listing agent where everybody just knows you for always sending out an email with new listings every week. You know, I, I my email has the new listings on there. And um, a lot of people know me for that. They'll tell their friends, they'll say, hey, um, they'll say, hey, you know, you know, get on Ricky's weekly email. You know, you'll get an email every week with all the new listings. You know, just sending out the new listings every week is gold. It's gold. Okay. So let me zoom this in. And if you guys have, if you guys have questions for me, just DM me on Instagram. Um, you know, there's so many comments I can't, I can't even keep up, but if you, if you have any questions for me, just DM me on Instagram and I'll, I'll get right on it. Okay. So this has literally been my, my subject line forever Gulf coast market report in the day. I want to brand this. I want this to be a brand. I want, I want to, to build a brand of an email, you know, Gulf coast market report, the date, man, this is, this is it. Okay. And then the preheader text is always going to be whatever the email is about. So I can always have the same subject. And then the preheader text here is which, is what they see in their inbox, but they don't, this disappears once they open the email up. Um, so here I talked about the condo sales um, uh, up 94% in March. You know, that's from last March. That's from the shutdown, you know, shutdown was last March. So obviously we had a, a huge uptick in number of transactions, you know, it was still cool, still cool to, cool to say it, right? It was still, still a real number that happened. So, even though it was from the shutdown to this year, but you know, it's just good to know these numbers. And so this is a week where I decided, okay, I want to share some stats, some market stats. Um, you know, and so I, I like, I like to kind of try to break it down uh, four weeks in a month. Whereas, you know, one week I do stats 
the next week I want to do like a, a deal or, or some listings or something, you know, a, a, you know, some property I think is great. You know, the next week I may do an article of some sort and then and then one week, uh, you know, like a restaurant, you know, and, and give your opinions on the stuff. When you go, you know, go to the restaurant, eat there and, and in your email, tell tell the story. Hey, me and my wife went to this place and I had the whatever and it was amazing. You guys need to check it out. And one thing you can do when you do your your restaurant emails is say, hey, reply back for your chance to win a twenty five dollar gift card. All kinds of people will reply back. It gives you a chance to engage with those people. And even if they do win the gift card or not win the gift card, if they don't win the gift card, then you can say, hey, I'm sorry you didn't you know, win the gift card, but I'd, I'd be glad to have lunch with you. I'll take you there. Lunch on me. And that gives you another opportunity to actually meet somebody. And that that's starting to open back up now. We're starting to you know, get to a place where we can actually have lunches with people again. And that's exciting. Because that, that's always been a big part of my business, to be honest with you, having lunches with clients, you know, hanging out, you know, breaking some bread, getting to know them better and um, just having a good time. So this heading has always been pretty similar here. You know, I make little tweaks and stuff as I go. OK, always a big, nice, really high resolution picture here. So some people open up this email just to see what the picture is going to be. Because it's different every time. So some people want to come in here and see what this picture is going to be this week. You know, they're just interested. I've got new condos, new listings, new homes, property search, live beach camp. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. Okay, so this is like I'll go, I'll go in here and show you where this goes. Oh, what happened there? Boom. Let's see. Edit. Let me show where this goes. Boom. So this this link is automatically updated every every day. Every time a new listing comes up, this this link. Um, you know, it adds it to this link, right? And if it's more than two weeks old, it takes it off of this link. This is a very good tool to have a link with all the new listings and you just post it on your website. If you guys want a website like mine, this custom website with all this stuff, listing by city, I've got Gulf Shores condos for sale. I've got all the complexes, right? It's got a, a lot of really cool things. It's got condo sales, right? Um, It's got all the condo sales this year here for people to search. If you guys want a website like this, Webinate. Webinate makes custom websites. That's at zerodiamond.com. They'll give you guys a discount there as well. And they'll make you a website just like mine. Okay. You'll have your own custom website, not one a, you know, a company gave you or you know, a real estate agent in a box website. Your own custom website that you can do stuff with, right? Do all kinds of cool things. But it's really good to have a link that has the new listings that gets updated. Then you can just have the same link. You know, I don't change these links. This is just the same link every week. And it goes to the new the new listings, new condos, new homes. And then we got the property search. OK, then I've got kind of the body, the body of my email. I don't normally put a put another image here, but I wanted to do this to kind of show them the chart of the spike in transactions, which by the way, guys, I mean, look at, you know, March, 2011, you know, all the way, you know, to March, 2021. I mean, this is the last 10 years of transactions in March condo, condo, uh, <clears throat> condo sales. So although it was a 94% increase from the shutdown last year, heck, it's way above. I mean, before that, the, the largest increase, the largest year was under 230. That was in 2017. I mean, that's massive. That's massive. It's a massive spike. So I've always got this here. Looking for the number one agent on the Gulf Coast. Call, text Ricky Carruth number. See all my listings, which just goes to my website. All this is normally the same from here down. So I just change up the body here and I'll go to another email here in a minute and show you. Just come in here. You know, I change the preheader text based on what I want to talk about. I change the body here. 
And then from here down is pretty much the same. And I'll come in here and change this, you know, every once in a while, every six months or so. Once I find something I really like, then I'll just kind of stick with it. Okay. Um, but look at the statement here. What a wild ride it's been since last March. Now that's a personal statement, right? That's me saying that. See, that, that that's what I'm saying is it, making this thing personable. You know, what a wild ride it's been since last March. That they, you know, they read that and they're thinking, you know, they're getting a little bit of me there, right? Let's hop back out and let's hop back out and look at another one. Let's see what this one looks like. Let me get it to where we can really see it here. Okay, so this one was this week's. This was this week's email. And I say, you know, of course, the same subject. One of the best times of year, because this is in between spring and summer, it's kind of a little lull, you know, before summertime down here on the beach. And so look at this, this look at this picture. New condos, new homes, search. This is literally just what I wrote. I hope you are at the beach right now. We're in one of the best times of year down here in between spring and summer. Or what I like to call the calm before the storm. This is a great time to enjoy some great weather without the huge crowds. If you come down and you would like to buy or sell, call me ahead of time and I'll be glad to meet while you are here. Okay, so just a little something something from a local. You know, nothing, nothing crazy. I didn't, you know, as you guys can see, I'm not sitting here saying, you know, hey, you know, you better sell, you better buy. You know, I'm just telling people like it is and just being genuine. And I'm thinking everything's long game for me. You know, in 2023, you're not going to care what you made in 2021. You're only going to care about what you make in 2023. Right. But 2023, your income is going to be predicated on how many people you added to your database in 2021. That's what you need to be thinking about. Too many of us are worried about. Too many of us are worried about how many deals we're going to close this year when it doesn't mean anything. <laughs> I mean, it means it means our survival and it means us paying our bills. And I get that. But if you quit thinking about that and just focus on building the database, I'm telling you, you'll have more than enough closings this year, but more so focusing on that huge 2022, that huge 2023. All right. That's where we're going here. We're, we're going to go into 2022, believe it or not, guys, we're going to hit 2023. 2024 is coming and you can't go back. So why not do what we need to do now to prepare for the, 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 the largest impact and results for 2022, 23, 24. I get we have to survive now and pay bills and we're new to real estate. We're trying to get our first deal. I understand all that, but you can do both. You can go after deals and also have this part of you who is also building a database, right? And then using this weekly email strategy to, to capitalize on this in a very cost efficient manner. Okay. All right, let's, let's do one more. Let's see, not a lot of comments coming in right this second. So if you guys, if you guys have any questions, um, I think I can, looks like the comments have slowed down just a little bit. So I think I can uh, answer some questions if anybody types one in while I'm going through another email. Let's see. All right, let's see. Let's let's go after this and let's see. All right. And again, guys, zero to diamond dot com. Uh, free course, Ricky's weekly email. Go to the link and look at all these emails. Use my template when you sign up for constant contact. They give you my template. They give you my template. All right, so beach is getting back to normal. This is kind of where I 
shared a little bit about our beaches coming back. And I didn't do anything too crazy, right? I just had a really good picture here, people playing on the beach. I said, after the pandemic and Hurricane Sally, tourists are coming back to the beach full force, and they did. Read the article on the comeback here, okay? And a lot of you guys take the article and you, you, you put it in the email. Don't do that. See how I made this really easy to read, and then it's a click here. If they want to read it, I'm not forcing them to read it. I'm giving them the option. Okay, so... This is the article it goes to, and it's just an article. All right, just an article. Same picture. It just talks about it. Talks about what's happening and what we got going on. Okay, right here, this was a little leftover from the week before. I just kind of left it in the bottom. I'll show you guys the email the week before. I left it in the bottom. Over 500 condos have sold along the Gulf Coast so far this year. Click here for the list. It goes to that list I showed you on, on my website. Then look, all this is the same as that week before. So all I really did was come in here and change all this around. All right. I want to do this, and then I want to go back in time with you guys. I want to go back to like five or six or eight years ago on here. So stay tuned. Let's see. Let's see. There was one where I talked about. Yeah, right here. I talked about uh, the the Floribama annual mullet tosses back. That's where we throw mullet. It's like a mullet throwing mullets of fish. Fish will fly this weekend. 30 year, 36 year tradition that brings over 30,000 people to Orange Beach every year. OK. Real simple stuff, guys. Nothing crazy. Don't do these long emails. See how I can scroll through this with one. I don't have to go like this and keep scrolling. It's just like one scroll and I'm done. I can see everything I need to do and I can click on things I want to click on. Real simple. Nice picture. Ready to roll. All right. Let's see. Now what I want to do. Let's see. I don't know what happened there. I'm going to go back in time here. Let's see. Can I show how we edit our templates? Okay. So, like editing a template is real easy. You go to create, email, and you can just pick one of these templates. All right, let's say you pick this one. All right, so now you're in here. You can change all kinds of stuff, right? Everything's kind of a drag and drop. So over here, you've got you've got your, you know, you've got your text blocks, right? You can go here, boom. You can actually move that to different places if you wanted to. All right. Um, when you do the text box, it could be on the side right there. You can have a picture here. You also have these layouts, okay, where you could do um, side by side pictures and different things. There's all the images I already have in there. And then here, uh, I can do different patterns in the back. I can change different colors, do different things. There's so many things you can do. And it's real easy. It's all drag and drop. It's all just right here. So it's not real difficult. If you guys need help with it, just, just let me know. And I'll direct you to some somebody on my team. And they can walk you through the entire thing. Okay? All right. Now, let's go back in time real quick. Let's see, emails, let's see. Old and new. All right, 2013, guys, y'all ready for this? Look at that. All right, hold on, let me, how do I blow this up? All right, look at this guy. 
2013. Look at me. Hundred and sixteen condos, forty seven homes sold since January first. Click here to re click here to request the list. Let's see where that goes. Now it goes to a thing. It probably goes just to email me because I didn't have a website. I didn't have a website. I literally um, it was like email me here to request the list. <laughs> like it didn't go to a website. It went to mail. You know, email me. Ricky Carruth, Alabama Florida Realtor, 11-year Gulf Coast Realtor. Buying or selling, market activity, prices on properties in the Gulf Shores, Orange Beach area are up 10% on average from last January, February. Let me know if you have any questions. I just put Crystal Shores 804 in a contract. Ricky Carruth, 2013, 15 condos slash homes sold slash under contract, 3 million. With 11 years experience, I know how to earn your business. I look forward to helping you. I want you to be fully informed of the latest market information. I look forward to representing you when you decide it's time to buy or sell. Please don't hesitate with any questions. Man, I was a smooth operator back then, wasn't I? Let's see when that was. That was February 20th, 2013. So by February 20th, I had either sold or put under contract $3 million worth of property that year all right man this has been this has been something else all right let me i'm going to show you guys one more time in case you missed it the constantcontact.com backslash ztd to get that free ebook start a free trial there with constant contacts use the promo code save 30 s-a-v-e three zero when you do turn it into a paid account and save 30% off for the first three months. This is what I've used for over 10 years. I will see in 2007, I was using just my Yahoo. And then I switched to constant contacts, probably 2010, I believe. Yeah, I think it was 2010, if not 2011. So right at 10 years, maybe 11 years. So be sure to go there, get the free ebook, 30% uh, off the first three months. And get started with this, guys. And like I said, reach out to me. DM me on Instagram. If you guys uh, DM me on Instagram, if you guys, you know, can't quite get this down. Um, if you can't quite get this down, definitely reach out to me and I'll hook you up with somebody on my team that will sit down with you and help you go through this and put this thing together. OK, I want to help you as much as I can possibly help you. So. All right, guys, uh, I hope you got tons of value out of this. As I said, that, that you know, search on YouTube, Ricky's Weekly Email Ideas. Uh, really go deep with that one. That's a great one. I can't say enough about how much that has kind of helped people move in the right direction as far as content goes. Keep it simple. That's the main thing. Keep it simple. Super successful people just keep everything very simple and in a very simple perspective on things. I mean, they look at people who are not succeeding and, they see them doing all these things and they're like, oh, my gosh, you know, it's just driving me crazy. You're trying all this stuff. And, you know, why don't you just do this? Just this one thing, you know. So anyway, much love to you guys. Uh, really, really appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. And I hope uh, hope you much success and I want to hear about it. So definitely keep the DMs coming. Let me know how things are working for you. The phone calls, the emails you know, listing sales, all that good stuff. And definitely come see me when I come to your city or anywhere close to you. Come see me. And um, and it, it, it humbles me when you guys come out and see me, shake my hand, want to take a picture, all that good stuff. And be sure to text me for a chance to win a free book. 251-312-8844. We'll see you guys next time. Much love.